Hey folks, Dave here. I came out to the shop this morning knowing that I needed to do a little minor maintenance on the laser. So I thought while I'm doing it, I may as well bring you folks along. So let's get right on it. I was up working with the laser last night because that's what you do when you have a laser. You work whatever hours you've, you've got trying to get some, uh, some products out. And I noticed that the laser was doing a slight jerk, like it had some resistance. And I know it's because of this rail. The rail gets residue on it, just like the products you work on in the laser bed, and you get the, the residue all over the wood. It, it collects up here. So what you have to do periodically is just wipe it off, wipe it down, roll the, uh, the laser with it and get these wheels cleaned off good. And then just wipe everything down. Get the rails cleaned up real good. Make sure there's no residue on them. Use a soft cloth, by the way. And then you want to use a silicon-based lubricant. And that's what the uh, the X-Tool folks, they provide this with every purchase. And I know it looks like a small container, but there's a lot of, lot of lubricant there. So just put a small amount on your finger after you make sure all of the uh, residue is gone. And just wipe it down. Just get some on that rail all the way down on both sides. all the way up and a little bit of uh, preventative maintenance will make sure you're getting the best performance out of your equipment and a longer life you want to get this rail on top real good and no matter what laser you have your maintenance will be similar for keeping these uh, keeping these rails cleaned up and lubricant on them, lubricated. Work it back and forth a little bit. And, I mean, while you're in here, you might as well take your soft cloth and wipe everything down. Keep it all nice and pretty. I recently done a video to clean the the laser lens for the X-Tool D1 Pro 40. I'll drop a link to that in the description. Uh, so if, you're, if your power is backing off, you're not getting good performance with your power, then it's your lens that's dirty, so get it cleaned up. And if you're getting jerky movements or you're getting skips in your the surface of your work, it's the residue it's on these rails, and if you'll do what we just done, you'll get better performance and prolong the life of your laser. Okay, there you go. That's it. Okay, folks. Well, there you go. Minor maintenance complete. So if you notice a little jerkiness in the movement of your laser, or if you're getting skips in the surface of your work, then you know to check the residue that's building up on the guide rails. And if you do that periodically then your laser will continue to run smooth and a little bit of maintenance will keep it working for much longer and you'll get better results out of it. Okay, folks, I appreciate you watching. I hope you got something out of it. If you did, please like and subscribe and we'll see y'all real soon. Thank you.